to enable.org presents Mathematical Literacy, Tariff Systems, Municipal Tariffs. <coughs> okay, sew sewage. A sewage is the uh, water that you use in the house that is basically to flush the toilet and to do the dishes and to take a bath. Okay, so that's taking grey water away. Okay, this uh, table was taken from uh, www.johannesbergwater.co.za on the 13th of May 2014. I basically, uh, well, I took a screenshot and then I cut it off. So, yes, the uh, um, tariffs for, for sewage, um, it says all below charges are exclusive of VAT. Um, private dwelling house on a single erf per, uh, per erf, uh, rand per month. Okay, so the first amount is up to and including 300 square meters. Now, if you have a, a property which is smaller than 300 square meters, you will pay 108 rand 39 cents per month for sewage. If you have a property between 301 square meters and 1,000 square meters, quite large, you will pay 211 rand per month. If you have a property between 1,001 square meters and 2,000 square meters, you will pay 309 rand 21 cents per month. And if you have a property larger than 2,000 square meters, you will have to pay 459 rand 94 cents per month and then they show the tariff increases it's probably for the next year right so because this was for the 2013-2014 um, year so let's for instance say you have a property between 301 square meters and a thousand square meters how much will you pay uh, on sewage for the next year. So let's do a calculation. <coughs> okay, so you have 211 Rand that you paid every month for the previous year and you multiply that with 100% which that, that represents the amount that you paid the previous year plus 9,8% and after the brackets I'll put a percentage sign this is not really how you would do it on a calculator but this is just to show that it's 100% plus 9,8% okay so that's 211 rand and I will time that times that with 109,8% And uh, if you use a simple calculator, it will be 211 times 1,098. And that means next year you will have to pay uh, that's a R, a Rand side, 231 Rand and it says 321, uh, 231 Rand, 678 and th therefore we will round it to 68 cents. So from next month, from the next year, sorry, you will have to pay 231 Rand 68 cents per month if you have a property that is larger than, sorry, that is larger than 301 square meters but smaller than a thousand square meters. Right, the next municipal tariff is water and sewage. Okay, so this comes from savingwater.co.za that on the 13th of May 2014. Okay, it says 
uh, Cape Town Water and Sanitation Tariff 2014 to 2015. The domestic single residential sanitation tariff remained linked to the water tariff at a rate of 70% of water consumption. 70% of 50 kiloliters is 35 kilo kiloliters. This means that water used for water garden irrigation is charged based on 70% of water consumption even though this water never reaches the wastewater treatment. The new tariff is effective from the 1st of July 2014. Should you have any questions regarding your, uh, how to reduce your consumption of water and con concomitant sewage I do not know what that word means sorry please give us a call water rhapsody will reduce your consumption by up to 90% without a change in lifestyle right so the water tariff if you use between if you use no water per month up to six kiloliters you will pay no money you don't have to pay anything then you are charged f for between 6 kiloliters and 10,5 kiloliters at 875 per kiloliter and including that, that is 998. Between 10,5 kiloliters to 20 kiloliters you will pay 14,30 per kiloliter. Between 20 and 35, you will pay 21 rand 18. Now, this is called the gliding scale, and I'll quickly show you how it works. And this is your sanitation tariff. Uh, you will pay 4 uh, uh, if you use 4 rand 20, this is 70% of your water consumption. 4 rand 20. Uh, 4,2 uh, to 7,35 kiloliters will pay 9 rand 41. Um, etc. Other tariffs, if you have a commercial property, you will pay 13 rand 51 uh, per kiloliter that you use, so you don't have a gliding scale, um, and 10 rand 35, 39 for sanitation, um, schools will pay less for water but also th 10 rand 39 for sanitation and industrial is 1351 rand for water and 922 for sanitation so let's quickly say you consume 19 kiloliters per month how much will your cost be now this is quite a lengthy calculation 19 kiloliters right <coughs> 19 is made up by a couple first of all the six f first six kiloliters is free everybody in South Africa gets six kiloliters free per month which is quite fit nice right between six and ten and a half so uh, if I go 19 minus six 13 remains and then I'll go 13 minus um, oh 10.5 minus 6 so it means minus four and a half there's four and a half kiloliters in this so I subtract four and a half from that And that gives me minus 13, 8,5 kiloliters. Right, so this is the first six kiloliters is free, then the second four and a half kiloliters. I will have to pay 9 rand 98 for four and a half times 9,98 and that gives me four and a half times 9.98 44 and 
91 cents. And then the last 8,5 kiloliters is charged at a higher price. So the last 8,5 is charged in this group, which is 14 rand 30 cents. So it's 14.30. So eight point five times fourteen thirty and that is hundred and twenty one rand fifty five cents. So all in all your total let's just make a T is equal to the six kiloliters that's free, so it's naught plus forty four ninety one. Oh, not the nicest four forty four ninety one plus this one two one fifty five two one fifty five. So your total, if you were to use nineteen kiloliters per month. Your total that you need to pay for water, that's not sewage, is 166 rand and 46 cents. So do you see you don't just pay, um, you don't just pay the 19 liters times with 1430, you pay in the different scales because they want to encourage people to use less water every month. Okay, water sewage, uh, Cape Town domestic tariff, uh, or, uh, oh sorry, this is also from, this is from Cape Water Solutions, that's here at Zeta, also on the 13th of March. Cape Town domestic water tariffs are up with the highest increase in the 6 to 10,5 kiloliters tariff. This 30% increase pushes up the cost of water from 6.64 to 8.66 per kiloliter. The city of Cape Town is, encu uh, is encouraging residents to reuse grey water and to collect rain water where possible. Uh, grey water is water that from your bath, for instance. So they want you to use your bath water or the water that you use in your sink or in your um, in your washing machine to, for instance, water the garden. The chart below indicates what you will now pay for water. So sewage is this is the amount for sewage this is the amount for water and this is the total charge it says the red line indicates the price that you will be paying for sanitation this is automatically calculated at 70 percent of your fresh water consumption so near now they've used that other table the gliding scale and they say if you were to use foot well let's say this is about 40 two kiloliters per month you will have to pay 400 rand per month on sewage now 40 42 kiloliters is a lot um you're about to if you use 22 and a half liters a month you will pay 200 rand for water uh, 180 rand maybe for sewage and the total charge is more or less 400 rand Okay, and the green line indicates the cost that you are actually paying for every liter of water that comes into your home. This is the sum of both the fresh water and the sewage charge. You literally pay twice for the water that you use, once as it enters your property and again when you leave. <coughs> This is quite interesting. So we can read anything off this table, uh, um, but every time you'll see that the amount for the red plus the amount for the blue equals the amount for the green. So the total charge is the green amount. This is very interesting. Okay, thank you very much.